there and welcome back to Bricks and Pieces. Today I'm going to show you how to make these amazing looking Mandalorian speeder bikes designed by Wordnuff on Instagram. Go check him out, I'll leave a link in the description. While these speeders do look amazing, they can be a bit fiddly to put minifigures in and this little beam is fragile here as it is only holding the bike together using that one stud there which connecting into that bowl. But apart from, but when you put a minifigure in they seem to hold together quite well and they do look brilliant in the end. First we'll start with the back section. So take one of these slopes and then what you need to do is get some one by one tiles and place them there and there. And then you need a one by one brick with studs on either side and place it at the front there and then you need another one by one but with a stud only on one side and this goes here you then get a cheese slope and put that under there to create the nice sloping angle up next you want to grab a jumper plate and one of these slope pieces and then you put those together like that you then need to get two of them and put them either side of here, like so. Then for the main body part you need one of these inverted slope pieces, a one, a one by two, or a one by two plate with the rounded edges and it must have those holes on one end because that is how it connects to the front section. And then what you need to do is get a one by one tile and connect the two pieces like so. And then finally get a one by one tile and place it there on the end and connect the two pieces together like so. Now for the head you need to take one of these these sloped one by four pieces. I believe one of them comes in the Mandalorian battle pack with the original speeders. Then you take a one by one plate and place it underneath there, like so. Then you also want to grab one of these one by two um, pieces with the bars hanging out. This makes this is important because this is what these hand pieces attach to to form the handbar handlebar details for the minifigure to hold on to. And place one either side. Next you grab another one of these pieces and a one by two slope but it's got the right angle with the studs on the other side and you place that on top. Then you grab another one of these 1x2s and place them right under there. And now you need to get one of these wing pieces but make sure you put it backwards so that the straight edge is facing forwards. Do that again on the other side. This mm. then clips under here like so. Next you need one of these, another one of these 1x2 pieces, but this time it's got the right angle with studs there facing up. And then you get another 1x2 jumper and a 1x2 trans clear piece right in there. And then underneath this you can put any sort of detail, I sh chose to put a grill piece that's what's great about these speeders, as you can build them with whatever sort of colours you want. For example, I've made one for Miss Mandalorian from the Battle Pack, and I've also made one for a Death Watch Mandalorian here. Anyway, be sure to go check out Wordnuff on Instagram. He's an amazing custom Lego builder. He does Halo, Star Wars and more. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.